All right, I'm back. Uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to add the sprites into a single object, and we're going to make that object move in the game. So what I want you to do is I want you to right-click object in the box, drop-down box, hit add object, name it, uh, player, whatever you want. I'll just name it player one. What you want to do right here in the sprite, where it says no sprite, you want to click that box beside it and click stand. Under that sprite image uh, file right there, you want to hit visible and solid. And depth, you want to change that by three. No persistent. All right, you want to add an event. Event. You want to hit key press left, key press right, key press up, key press down. Add event, key release left, key release right, key release up, key release down. Up in your events, you want to. Uh, select press left all right what you want to do is you want to make your character move left so what you do is you grab this little red snowflake here and move in the move tab drag it over click and drag it over to your actions list and you'll get this window right here so we're trying to get him to move left so we're going to hit directions we're going to click that left we're going to change the speed to 4. Uh, you can do it anywhere between 1 or 10. I, I, I suggest, you know, 4, 5, 6. Don't go any anywhere beyond 6. Um, 4 is good, so we'll stick with 4. Don't hit the roll of the box. Just click OK. Uh, down in the main 1 uh, tab, you want to click this little red sprite right here that looks like a little red Pac-Man. I'm going to click him and hold and drag over to the actions list. And you'll get this other pop-up box. Now what you want to do is you want to select your left sprite. So you're changing your stand sprite into the left sprite when you hit the left key. The sub image, change that to negative 1. And the speed, 0 0.5. Just hit OK. Now you're pretty much going to be doing the same thing up, right, and down. Uh, Go to move, get the red snowflake, drag over. And this is up, so we'll select up, speed four. Okay, main one, change sprite, drag over to the box, pop up box, uh, select your right I mean up uh, so that would be forward select forward sub image negative 1 speed 0 0.5 okay right you want to hit move red snowflake drag over now we're making a move right so we're gonna click right speed 4 okay Main one, you want to go to the red Pac-Man, drag him over there. Uh, pick your right sub-image, negative one, speed, 0 0.5, okay, and down. Select red snowflake, drag over, select down, speed, four. Okay, main one, change sprite, down, sub image, negative one, speed, 0 0.5, Oop. 0 0.5, okay, now you want to go to the least left, right, what you're going to do is you're going to hit move, red snowflake again 
this time you're just going to hit the middle right here in the middle just click that speed nothing zero just leave it like that and go back to main one you want to hit change sprite and you want to hit stand you want to make him stand hit negative one speed 0 0.5 left up you want to hit uh, the red snowflake drag over up speed zero you want to keep that as zero click OK main one drag the pac-man over select stand sub image negative one speed 0 0.5 click OK right you want to select the red snowflake select right speed zero that's fine exit out of it all right red pack man click stand sub image negative one speed 0 0.5 okay and down move down speed zero you want to keep that as zero main one you want to hit the red pack man pull him over to actions hit stand negative one sub image speed 0 0.5 hit okay now you're pretty much done with your character uh you could give them other actions other attributes in the left right up down whatever whatever have you but right now we're basically just making them be able to walk around in a room uh, I'm just going to make a simple background, a white background. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to leave the name. Edit. Okay. Okay. Uh, and we're going to create a room. Add a room. Now, in the room, you really don't have to have walls around the sides right now. Uh, in this tutorial because I haven't set the gravity or anything like that so he'll basically just be floating around in there so what you want to do is you want to click player one right here and just click anywhere in here that you feel like you want to place them. you can click them down here drag them around uh, just anywhere you want to I'll just put them in the middle and that's pretty much it. You just hit uh, you get, hit the backgrounds. Go down here to no background. A little drop box. Hit background zero. And that'll add the white background. And that's it. Just click uh, the little green check mark right here at the top. And hit play. Now he can walk around. Looks like he's walking around. Yee, I'm walking. I'm walking around. Well, that pretty much sums up my tutorial. Uh, thanks for watching, and don't forget to comment. Thank you.